No kids or nannies. William leak proof of Meg children with big snub unmasked truth about Archie birth. Prince William was not impressed by Harry and Meghan's attempts to keep the birth of their son Archie a secret, a royal author has claimed. The Duke of Cambridge reportedly felt the efforts were prima donna and did not think too highly of the way the announcement was handled by the couple. Archie arrived on May 6, 2019 at London Hospital The Portland, where many royals have been born over the decades including Princess Beatrice and the Cambridge's three children. But in a huge break from tradition, the news that Meghan had gone into labor came at around 2 p.m. when it was reported by Sky News. Royal births are usually reported by the household, with all three of the Cambridge births being announced by the palace. William's alleged disapproval was reportedly the reason behind him and Kate waiting a full eight days to visit the couple and their newborn, reports Birmingham Live. Robert Lacey has written in his new book Battle of the Brothers, which is making headlines, about William's view. William did not think too highly of Harry and Meghan's prima donna maneuvers to conceal the birth of their son in May 2019, Lacey wrote in his book. This impression was confirmed by the failure of William and Kate to visit the new arrival for a full eight days. The couple said afterwards, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are pleased to announce they have named their firstborn child, Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor. This afternoon their Royal Highnesses introduced Her Majesty the Queen to her eighth great-grandchild at Windsor Castle. The Duke of Edinburgh and the Duchess Mother were also present for this special occasion. Archie made his first public appearance in May of that year. In her first public remarks since giving birth the Duchess said, It's magic, it's pretty amazing. I have the two best guys in the world so I'm really happy. As her husband held their son, Meghan wore a white sleeveless wrap dress and added, he has the sweetest temperament, he's really calm. As they both laughed, Harry said, I don't know who he gets that from. Meghan added, he's just been the dream so it's been a special couple of days. In other news, Prince William and Kate Middleton appeared to give the cold shoulder to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle at Friday's Thanksgiving service for the Queen's Jubilee at St. Paul's Cathedral, reported People. The special service, planned as a tribute to Queen Elizabeth's 70 years as monarch, marked the first time that the Cambridges and Sussexes were seen together at the same event since 2020's Commonwealth Day service, just days before Harry and Meghan stepped away from royal life. As per People magazine, as Prince William and Kate made their way to their seats at the St. Paul's Cathedral on Friday, they passed Prince Harry and Meghan's pew, however, kept their eyes forward. Prince Harry also reportedly avoided looking at his brother directly, keeping his eyes forward as well. Meghan and Harry arrived in the UK on Wednesday for the Queen's Jubilee in what marks the first time they have returned as a family since Meg's sit. While it has been reported that the Queen has already met them and their daughter Lilibet, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are yet to be seen with the monarch, the Queen pulled out of Friday's service after complaining of discomfort the day before.